I um one thing that I get from this webcam is is a lot of exhibitionism, a lot of kind of putting myself out there to give a message and uh, as a return um, I've had people tell me that I need to commit suicide and film it on a webcam. I've had people um, prank call me using my telephone number and there's been a vast amount of disrespect that I've gotten in this town San Luis Obispo. Um, in psychology we are so scared of change that when there's something that's providing an extra stress we go toward alcoholism or we go toward other addictions that might deal with possible um, illicit behavior that is socially not acceptable and the more we give to our pleasures that could be the alcoholism or other addictions we start losing sight of a character that maybe when our mothers cared for us as children imparted invested in us and so we start depriving ourselves of of a standard of living a social class when we give no respect to one another because we feel like failures and we don't know how to believe in caring for men um, in ways that matter all because we have become pussies in helping ourselves uh, formulate a a positive community for the future um, people will drift away and we'll find ourselves all the more lonely I have found that most of the gay people in my life in this county are poor and they're not thriving they're not able to take gay cruises they're not able to travel and so they put their money toward an instant gratification which is buying cigarettes they also will litter cigarette butts and I've been finding that there's a lot of gay men out of the closet some of them in the closet are very rude societal and when it comes to socio-political uh, reputation and legalizing same-gender marriage we need a higher moral standard for gay men and the men in this area will not let me uh, tell them that we need to bring some correction in the social behavioral sciences so that we will not go toward those addictions we will not go toward um, alcohol when we are feeling stress um, I am doing all I can to not be brought down to a level of cultural mediocrity and when I am crying out and when I am reaching forward uh, and I'm discussing these issues with people that are below my social class or maybe they're at my social class or even they're at a higher social class they're not giving me the benefit of the doubt that I could very well be part of that social transformative change and I'm not getting the respect because sex has become too easy because going toward alcoholism and buying cigarettes has become too easy littering has become too easy lying and deceiving people has become too easy this underclass even if you come from money or you have money it deals with language knowing how to talk to people and create a bond and a trust so that we can institute basic things in society.